welcome back to the channel um okay so you're given an array of integers called nums and a target called value and you need to find the values and to find two distinct numbers in the array that add up to the target value and return their indices or indexes the indices must be returned in any order um, you can assume that there is always exactly one solution like always there is a solution okay <clears throat> there's multiple ways to solve this problem and I guess a good way to solve it this um, to be um, to use a map uh, like to solve this problem efficiently we must like use like a hash map also known as like um, a dictionary uh, the hash map helps us keep track of the elements we have seen so far and um, allows us to find the needed value quickly like achieving an efficient time complexity instead of just doing a two instant loops um, so let's try to do this uh, step by step so if we want to do map so first we do this by create uh, a hash map so const map equals new map <coughs> and I'll make a for loop here um, okay so um, the map stores basically key values um, it will be stored like key value pairs where the key is a number of the is, is a number from numbers and the value is its index in the array so this is how it works um, after that we need to iterate um, uh, iterate through the, this one so okay, for let i equals zero let's just uh, spread out so it will be easier for us to look i i uh, should that should be less than nums dot length <coughs> and i plus plus okay this is looks good okay um if we want to think about it first we need like uh for each number in nums we need to calculate the comp um, the complement like which is the value that we need to uh we uh, the value that we added to the current number um <coughs> will basically equal the target because for example um um the the, the physically like let just let just create the, the the variable and i guess it will be understandable like const um let's call it complement or we c you could make it remain it will be equals target minus um nums of i and um basically um this complement is basically the, the number that we need to find in order to make sure that yeah we find the two numbers that add up to the target so again for each number in nums we need to calculate the complement which is the value that we when added to the current um that uh, when added to the current number will equal the target um and after that we need to check if the complement is already in the map so if if that was the case if uh, map dot has mm, the complement if that was the case i would do would love to do it like that return we need to return the um uh, i and also we need to return um map the index of the other number map dot, dot get i guess because and complement so we'll get its value no 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 yeah and um and also we need if that wasn't the case we need to store we need to store uh, the current value so say map dot set uh, nums of i to be equals to i okay let's understand what we have done here so <coughs> we need to check if the complement is already in the map if it is uh, this means we have previously seen the other number required to reach the target in this case um in this case uh the um in this case we re return the we return the indices 
of the complement and the current number. If the complement is not in the map, uh, we need to add the current uh, number and its index to the map. And after that, we return the indices. Uh, uh, after that, sorry, sorry. After that, we continue looping. Like when the solution is found, because in the description said that there is always a solution. When the solution is found, we return the indices and an array. Um, we can make uh, an example for that. So let's. Um, I could make example walkthrough uh, for you guys. Um, let's just do it like that. First, let's submit the code and make sure it, it's working. Yeah, it is working. Okay, that's nice. Okay, let's make an example walkthrough so we understand what's going on. So um, let's assume that we have here um, uh, nums that equals uh, 2, 7, 11, 15, and we need to find the target. So um, we first iterate um, the first iteration, which i, uh, I will equal uh, 0, and um, uh, the current number will be uh, uh, is uh, the current number at, at the i, it will be two, uh, and the, so the complement. The complement will equals um, I guess will equal seven because it's two minus nine is equal seven. So we need to search for the map um, and let's see the map. Right now the map is empty; it has nothing, so the map doesn't have the the complement. So uh, this if statement doesn't work. Uh, so we set the map two to zero. It will be happen like that, and we have the second iteration. So um, i will equals one right now. So um, nums of i will equal seven. So the complement equals seven minus target. It will equals two. So I say does map has two. It actually has two. So we return it. So this is how it works. So yeah. That's it for this video and I hope you like my content. If you like my content, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss any video and see you guys in future problems.